Okay, here is it in four diagrams. Rusty Rocket's low-cost hacking method from the breadboard diagram perspective first, and then we're going to have the motor, micro bit, and battery pack connectors. And then I will go over my breadboard with you. But um, I want you to see these first. So pins one, two, and three, left to right. The silver part of the transistor is on the back of this. And here we are looking at the 1K resistor in line on pin 1, and then also on pin 1 is a wire to microbit ground. On pin 2 of the TIP120 transistor, we have the diode beginning and going out to bridging to pin 3 of the transistor. And then also on pin two is an, a wire, a jumper wire to the DC motor. On pin three of the transistor, we have the diode pin, the uh, jumper wire to microbit pin zero, and a jumper wire to the battery. Next, from the motor diagram perspective, we have one wire that goes to the power and one wire that goes to tip 120 pin 2. So let's see if I call that out. In here to the DC motor, right? That works. Yep, yep, yep. Good. And then here's the microbit perspective. Microbit pin 0 to tip 120 pin 3. Let's see if we call that out here. Right, tip 120 pin 3. This is good. And then microbit ground to tip 120 pin 1. So over here we have to microbit ground from tip 120 pin 1. And from the battery pack perspective, we have the ground wire going to tip 120 pin 3 so to battery right and then a positive to DC motor so let's go over here to the battery pack to power I guess I should be a little more consistent in this but I will post these on my website or somewhere so you can see them but in the meantime you can follow this diagram